hello everyone welcome to the video and in this video we are going to see how you can easily get data from any pdf file in a very easy manner to analyze that in power bi and at the end i will also show you how to make it fully automated with the power of power bi now let's get started before we move forward in the video let me tell you that BritainX has an exclusive workshop on Power BI and data analytics. The link is in the description and we will talk more about it later in the video. Now let's get back to our topic. Do you want to convert boring looking data in Excel just like this to stunning looking dashboards in Power BI just like this? If you want to learn all of this, then join me in my 9 rupees Power BI domination workshop. So let's say you joined a company recently and your boss gives you this particular website. Now this is a website with a PDF, right? And he asked you to get the data, particularly this data. Now this is an example, but let's say you come across a situation and the condition is you have to make it automated. So don't go and do like this, right? You can always copy and paste like this, but it is a bad practice. And where you will paste, you will paste in Excel, then it's a lot of manual task, right? So wouldn't it be great if we have an automated way to do this? Actually, we have with Power BI, okay? So let me just download this particular PDF and see how we can get this data in our Power BI to analyze in an automated way, okay? So I'll just click on save button and this will get downloaded. So as you can see, this get downloaded on my PDF. Now let's see how we can extract this particular data. So I have the Power BI already opened. So let me click on get data and I will click on more. Then I will search here for PDF, right? So I get PDF, I'll click on connect. Now I know that this is the uh, PDF data that I have just downloaded. I also downloaded it previously, so I, I have two copies of it. So let me click one of them and click on open. Now you see Power BI is able to extract the tables that we have in the PDF file. So you see this is one kind of table that we have but I don't think we need it. Let's go to the second one. Oh this is also a table and if I go to that PDF I think this is this particular table right but we want this one right the third one. So if I go here and yes you can see we are getting the third table right. So this is the table that we want so I will click here and i think i also need to do some transformation so let me click on transform data now as you can see i am in the power query window so let me just uh, sort the columns properly so i will move this car to here then i need to have driver and then i need to have engine and then i need to have date but what i see here the date is in text format it's not in date format which is not good so what i will do is i will click here and convert it to date oops i got some error now why is that because if i cancel this one you see the date is in the format of mmddyy so first it comes the month then it comes the date because 15 is not a month right 15 is a date and then it's the year so 63 64 97 very old right so then how to do it how to convert it so what we need to do is we need to use the local okay so i will click here and then you see there is an option called as using local right before we move on into the topic let me inform you that data analysis and business intelligence has become a crucial part of any industry today and i guess you won't like to lag behind others right well if you want to become irreplaceable in your data analytics career Join our 3 hours Power BI and Data Analysis Mastery Workshop in which we will not only teach you how to perform top-notch data analysis 
but will also make you build stunning dashboards so that you can become one of those top 1% of Power BI users who snatch some high paying jobs. So what are you waiting for? Join our workshop by clicking the link in the description below. Now let's get back to our topic, right? So I'll click here and you know that the MMDD YY format is popular in US, right? So I need to choose the US local there. Here I will choose date. And now here instead of English India, I will choose English United States. This one. And if now if I click OK, you will see everything converted to date very easily, right? Then I can rename this as something like PDF table. And then I can put close and apply. So now you see we already have the table and now we can easily analyze. So if I put car here and then engine speed here and then I can convert it into a visualization. So I can see which car uh, has the highest speed. So I can see, see that is the green monster, right? So yeah, this is very easy. But now comes the coolest part, okay? So what if in that website they keep on updating their PDF? daily but what we have done is we downloaded the pdf and from that pdf we are getting the data but what if that pdf is getting updated daily is there a way so that without the need of downloading the pdf we can get the data actually yes there is a way so what i'll do is let me go to the transform data so now what i will do is i'll click on new source and here i will choose web right and and now what I will do is I will provide this particular URL, right? And Power BI is smart enough to know that the link actually points to a PDF file. So it actually extracts the PDF. So you see the magic happening right now, okay? So you see this is the same table that we have but now we are not getting this table from a locally downloaded PDF but from online. So if I click here and click on OK, I end up with the same data here. And then I can do all my transformation that I already did, right? So you see how easy it is to get the data from any PDF file, not just by locally downloading it but from a URL as well. I hope you learned a lot from this video and I will see you next time. Please do like, comment, share the video and subscribe to our channel for more such informative videos. Also, do check out our workshop link in the description. We'll see you there. Thank you.